What's up guys? So, few of you might have noticed I haven't been posting recently, and probably most people haven't noticed. I want to explain why I haven't been posting videos. She also said I'm using a Snapchat filter, so it's not exactly how my face actually looks, and it looks like it's not really tracking my lips that well for some reason. I don't know why, but so yeah, for anyone who, first of all, for anyone who's saying no true femme cell, um, I actually, I look worse than this, which is, not that I look that great with this filter, but, yeah, um, I look, uh, worse than this, and I should also explain that I'm uploading this video to two different channels, so, probably a lot of people don't really know what fem cells are, probably don't even know what incels are, which, I'm not really gonna spend a lot of time explaining that, because I want to get into the video, but, yeah, I might do some stuff at the end of the video that are unique to each channel, but just, um, I want to say that the beginning part of this video is going to be identical on both channels, so I'm guessing most people aren't subscribed to most, to both of my channels, so I'm just pausing here because uh, I live with my parents and I don't want to hear them, them to hear me talking. Even though I am using a voice changer to change how my voice ch sounds, but I still don't want to hear them. So I'm still like sound mostly male, but yeah, so uh, yeah, I'm uploading this to both channels. So some of the things I'm, I say might like the fem cell thing and people on the other channel. The older channel I'm uploading to is called Grossly Incandescent Snowflake. And I do gaming videos and I also do vlogs where I talk about my life. And also just different manosphere topics like incels and red pills and black pills and all sorts of things like that. And then the new channel, it's called TransPog. That's P-A-W-G. It's an acronym. It's short for Fat Ass White Girl. Which is basically a thick white woman, which I'm... These are actually, um, breast forms that I have in here. So, like, most of this is, um, I'll just show you. Yeah, it's, and they have nipples, so I have, like, a thing covered in nipples. Yeah, it's, uh, they're, I think they're F cup. I don't know, it wasn't, like, between going from double D cup to F cup, it wasn't, like, that much extra money. Um, yeah, so just <laughs> full disclosure, this isn't, I didn't get surgery or anything like that. It's, but it's most, what well, you've seen above it, it's, I mean, I am on hormones, but it's like I'm B-cup at most. And part of that's just like, cause I'm 40 pounds overweight. So it's like, there are some breast buds, but it's also a lot of man boobs. Yeah, I don't know why the lips aren't sinking that well. Like, when I turn my head, it seems to be... So, yeah, why haven't I been uploading videos? So, um, for one thing, I've just been really depressed. Um, I've also been having pain in my hands. I have chronic pain in my hands, because I have... I have a severe chronic illness, which I've talked about in my grossly incandescent snowflake, but it, it's, I've been diagnosed with Lyme disease, which seems pretty accurate based on, like, I've had a rash and I, or I was bitten by a tick, and I was bitten by a tick in a place that has high, um, incidence of Lyme, Lyme disease, so. And unfortunately, it wasn't diagnosed early because doctors are just terrible at treating the chronic illness, so. If I'd gone on antibiotics right away, I might have had like a full recovery or... So yeah, the depression, the chronic pain in my hands. And the other thing is, besides those two things, which are pretty big things, there really hasn't been that much interest in my videos. And I do just want to say that I do appreciate all the comments and people who leave likes on the videos that they like. I do appreciate that, I read all my comments, I mean that's not that hard at this point because I don't get many comments as you've probably noticed, but like for the past year, 
uh, with grossly incandescent snowflake. Um, let me just see here. Yeah, it says over the past year or so, I've gotten 12,500 views, 220 likes, and 71 dislikes. So about 2% of the viewers like the video. And there's also, as you can see, like a lot of dislikes. And also like us, 1% of viewers leave comments. So, you know, like it is what it is. If people don't like the video, like I mean, it just means that I have to do better quality videos, which is, I mean, fair enough, but at the same time with all my health issues and depression and stuff, like I don't, don't really, I'm not really motivated to do videos. Uh, with the transpog, like, I didn't say what that was, I, I mean, the names kind of suggest what it is, but basically I'm, sh mo the main thing I'm doing is showing off my body. And, believe it or not, there are, like, a de decent amount of heterosexual males interested in me, uh, despite, well, probably actually because I'm trans, but, um, yeah, I've also been posting on some adult sites, and, I don't know, like, I'm not really into interested in sex chatting or whatever, so, I ignore most of the messages from guys, I, I've got, like, some dick pics, which were not, not solicited by me, but, like, it's a porn site, so, like, I do have a lot of videos recorded, especially for Glow and Condensed Snowflake, but with those videos, a lot of them take a long time to edit, and I do have a few edited, but since I don't know how many videos I'm going to be producing in the future, I've kind of not uploaded any new ones just because I don't want to, like, once I run out of those, like, I'm out, so... If I do start uploading more videos after this, there might not be a lot of them. It might be like once every week or once every other week or a few times a month. I don't know, but um, right now I just can't maintain. Like I was trying to do two videos a week for each channel, so it's like four videos a week, which is... I like doing the videos, but just like I said with all the other things going on. And yeah, I have... I have like an acne thing here. I don't know what's, what that's from, but whatever. I don't know. People are probably noticing it, so I might as well comment on it. Yeah, I don't know if I'm even going to do like a separate ending for each channel. The, the new channel, Transpog, um, at least like the stuff where I'm trying on clothing, at least doesn't involve like a lot of editing, so like my hands aren't bad, but it's it's like physically exhausting. So I haven't recorded a lot of that. I've actually been really busy with this new website. Um, it's not new, but it's, I started using it recently. It's called AliExpress, and it's like Amazon, but it's in China, and it's like. It's kind of shady. There's like a lot of sellers who like either don't send you the stuff or they send you the wrong thing or they try and get extra money out of you. So it's a little bit like a mix between eBay and Amazon in that like you kind of have to have like a certain amount of trust in the seller because otherwise they can screw you over without like a lot of consequences. I've, yeah, I've been really busy with that. I ordered a lot of clothes, so like I'm hoping, and I'm, the main reason I ordered the clothes is so I could do it, to try them on for YouTube, because I can't transition um, for a lot of reasons, because of my health, because they don't pass, because I live with my parents who are against it, so, like, this is the only time I can be female and be seen as female, or somewhat female. I mean, some people aren't going to recognize me as female, and I mean, there's just, there's not a, nothing I can do about it. Like, I can't force people, and I mean, like, I don't think of transgender people exactly the same way as cisgender people. Like, I think of trans women differently than cis females, so I mean, I don't offend some trans people, but at the same time, like, if they, like, if they ask themselves, they probably do that. They probably think of transgender people differently than cisgender, but 
Even if they're not seeing the same as cis female, I still want to be seen as female, so. Um, yeah, I got this, um, this, this dress. I mean, I'm not wearing any, I'm not wearing any shapewear, so, like, um, yeah, you can see my, um, not really, not very shapely without shapewear, but, Remember to censor out that part where my where the filter didn't show my or show my real face. I don't want to show my real face. But anyway, um, thanks for watching, guys. And yeah, I will be reading the comments. So definitely leave comments if you're interested. And if you do watch the video and you do enjoy the video, please leave a like. If you did like the video. I'd ask you, first of all, while you watch the video, if you don't like it, but if you have any suggestions on how you want me to improve the videos, let me know, because I... This I'm doing with a webcam, so I can do the... Uh, it's a Snapchat filter, but I'm doing it... There's a program for PC. Hashtag PC Master Race, but... Yeah, I don't have this camera lined up accurately, so I'm, like, kind of crooked. I... Um, whatever. Uh, it's too late now. I already recorded the whole video, so. Yeah, like, the, for the try for the, for the new channel, like, the try-ons, like, I'm, I'm trying to, uh, get better recording settings for my camera, because they're, like, I don't have, like, the greatest lighting set up. And I'm also using a digital SLR camera, so it's not, like, made for shooting video. So... Um, yeah, and then, like, for grossly incandescent snowflake, at least for the gaming videos, like, I'm hoping to upgrade my computer at some point, but I spent all this money on clothes, and not only really that, I bought, I bought a female, somewhat re realistic female mask, it, it's actually... I got for under a hundred dollars on AliExpress. It's, um, now I can do like the try on holes without like cutting out my head because I I bought some new wigs too. I bought like a Harley Quinn wig, which I'm not really a fan of Harley Quinn, but I like the aesthetic and like the old more the old the more the old one where she's like the black and red. Um. But yeah, I'm not not really a fan of the character. I mean, there actually is a similar character in fiction I like though, which is from Ro Romeo and Juliet, Merc Mercutio. I like him, and like in some ways he's like similar to um, Harley Quinn, but the difference is he's benevolent or she's malevolent, and I guess like I just don't really like evil characters that much. So, um, so yeah, I'm not. I'm not just for anyone who does see the Harley Quinn. I also bought some, like, uh, Harley Quinn outfit. And there's actually Harley, Harley Quinn. Let me hold on a second. Yeah, not the greatest. Yeah. But, um, yeah. It's, it's, at least it's not my real face. I'm not. Gamers rise up. That's like a meme. Um, so yeah, like I'm not, I'm not doing it like I'm not doing the Harley Quinn just to like because she's popular. It's not. That's not why I'm doing it. I, I just like saw this, like I came across this filter. I also saw these like jester types, which are like black and red. I don't know if they were. They didn't say Harley Quinn on them. They might have been, in, although they might have still been intended to be for her, people doing Harley Quinn, but yeah, these like black and red tights I really liked. And then uh, I just came across like a cheap outfit, and since then I've come across some other outfits, and I thought I'd buy, I ordered the wig, but it hasn't gotten here yet. I was, I was hoping to do this video with a wig, but it's. Yeah, so I mean, you get to see my real hair, which is kind of a mess. Curly hair is hard to manage. Um, but yeah, anyway, so 
Uh, thanks for watching, guys.